as a force-sensitive smuggler related to Lady Corvax and Mustafar. Darth Vader and the Empire capture your ship over Mustafar and imprison you. Tricked into helping Vader find the Bright Star, which is filled with the life of Mustafar, you realize what you've done and must find a way to stop Vader and escape with your life. I haven't played many VR games recently, but I don't remember having this many problems. It didn't take away too much from the story, but the movement would glitch and send me outside of the map. The campaign has a very interesting and compelling story. You're a smuggler who's drawn into a conflict with Darth Vader due to your heritage. The story offers more insight into the history of Mustafar and why it looks like as it does, as well as Darth Vader's obsession with saving Padme. Everything felt true to Star Wars, and the ending leaves it open to future stories. The only thing I would change is the excess of walking and the inability to explore different paths and push different buttons that may not be part of the story but still affect the game. Every Star Wars fan has dreamed of wielding a lightsaber and using the Force. This game fulfills that dream and more. The combat is extraordinary and offers multiple styles throughout the campaign and dojo. There are different enemies like stormtroopers or training droids that force you to defend and attack in different ways. Once you get going with the lightsaber, blaster, and the force, it feels like you're right there in Star Wars. It's exhilarating. The customization also allows you to wield different colors and dual wield lightsabers, allowing for an even more authentic and personalized experience. It only happened a few times. At once it allowed me to see the entire planet without the castle in the way, so it wasn't too bad. I just had to restart the section. The other difficulty that I had was the motion controllers, where it made it too hard to move my hands to a specific position. This problem was more frustrating, but eventually I figured out how to make it better. Exciting combat and well thought out story are tampered with the technical difficulties that come with virtual reality, earning the game a rating of 8.5 out of 10. Make sure to like, subscribe, follow me on social media, and comment down below what content you'd like to see in the future. As always, thank you all for watching, and remember, the Force will be with you, always.